Hello guys, Rafik is here from USOFT. In the previous video, we already created a database and code form as a new feature and access it by an account with an administration role. What we should know is all features created from code management will automatically be assigned to the administrator. But how about we access the new feature by another account and another role? So now, I want to explain about Badasso permission role and user management. These features can help us to manage who can access features and who cannot, okay? First, let's head to the role management. As you can see here, there's two default roles when you install Badasso. That is administrator and customer. So, next let's head to the user management menu. We will create a new user and assign it with customer role. We can click add and then fill the available field. For example, we will give it name called graphic and then the email graphic at email.com and the password is default one two three four five six and then we can assign this account with verified email so we don't need to do confirmation email letter okay and then we can skip the avatar and additional info because we can fill it later after finish we can click save and then we can assign a role to the new user uh, with click three dots right here and then click roles next we can assign the customer role and then click set selected role for user okay it's success so we already have a new user with customer roles let's try the new user by logout first and Login with the new user. So we already logged in with new user. And as you can see, there's no foods and foods categories menu here. Because we have not assigned the related permission to the customer role yet. So we need to assign it via administrator account and then let's go back to administrator account again we must log out first and then login okay let's head to the roles management menu now click the three dots on customer role and then select permission search for foods and food categories okay first foods we must check it and then food categories after we have already assigned it we can click set selected permission for all so let's go back to the account with customer role As you can see, now food and food categories menu already show up and we can access it and manage the data. Okay. Okay, that's it. If you have any question, please comment below. Thank you. See you in the next video.